What's up guys? So today we're fishing with some live mullet. I went out last night and I lost two big snook on live mullet. So today I'm back out for revenge. Got a live well full of mullet right now and we're gonna start hitting seawalls, bridges, whatever. We're trying to catch some big snook, maybe some big jack as well. We're about to get at it. Approaching a wall right now, got the Saragossa rigged up. And as we're approaching the wall, a huge blow up just happened on it. So maybe the fish didn't get that mullet and he might still be perusing the wall. We might be able to get right on him here. Right here yesterday is where I had a snook whale it and I got broken off. Oh! <laughs> That's a snook right there. I don't know if he has it or not. Yeah, he has it. He has it. We're going to give him a moment here. Gosh, that was a nasty whale. Broken off again on the rock. That's fantastic. Oh, God almighty. That's a jack. I gotta get away from that dock. <laughs> All right, well, just broke a snook off in the exact same spot I broke one off yesterday, and here comes a jack. Save the day. Literally about two seconds after that snook broke off. It's not very big, but he hit it like he's 75 pounds. What a guy. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's great. It's a beautiful, beautiful sound. This fish is so little, and he's freaking fighting so hard. Oh my God. Just get your head up. All right, first fish of the day right there, just a little jack revolve, probably about five, six pounds. And that is why I pretty much always keep a spinning rod rigged up with an artificial, even when I'm fishing live bait, because right there, I was an idiot again and got broken off probably by the same snook on the same exact wall. And literally the second I turned my camera off, these school of jacks started running down the wall, hitting bait. And I picked up spinning rod with the artificial and there he was. But hopefully we'll find some bigger fish in this today. Here we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Take two, everybody. Uh, here we go. Oh, that's just fantastic. That's just fantastic. Get him. The fish are alive today. This is nice. All right. So I don't think that fish is gonna be willing to come off the wall. Maybe it is, I don't know. So we're gonna sling her right back there, see if we can get us slamming. Oh, come on. Push him up on the wall, that's a snook, that's a snook. Get him, get him. Get, yeah, yeah, ooh, yeah, ooh, okay. No, oh, it's Jack, I take everything back. That might've been a snook. I know I'm all over the place right now, to be honest. Did he get it? No, he didn't get it yet. Now we got boat wake. We'll see if they get scared away from it. Whale, whale, whale. Leisurely boaters are ruining my fishing. Scum of the earth. Sling it up in there. See if they uh, are into that. That they are. What are you in now? I understand what the deal was. It's just small jack. All right. We're gonna horse this baby in here and keep throwing and see if we can find that snook we're looking for. But today's great. We're getting a lot more bites than I have been over the past like week or so. So it feels good to be, oh my gosh, get out of my trolling motor. <laughs> feels good to be back in fish. Jack Revolve number two, about the same exact size, probably from the same school that was running down the wall that we caught one off earlier here. But, 
things are looking good. We're catching some fish. I'm slimed up. We've seen some snook. We're still looking for a big snook or a big jack, but I'm happy to be catching fish. The school jack going off right now. That was atrocious. They're eating. They're eating. It's just a freaking marauder group of jacks going. Oh, oh, okay. My bad. <laughs> there he goes. There's just another school of little jack. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Oh God, <laughs> there's a jack following him all the way to the boat and they saw the boat and freaked out. It was a big one too, bigger than the ones we've been catching. Uh-oh, uh-oh, oh, that looked like a much bigger fish. It looks like a big jack or ball possibly. Or not, not as big as I thought it was. Don't mind me. You want if you want to sit on top of the console. Oh gosh, that was a snook right there. That is a snook murdering my mullet soul. Just clobbered him. I don't know if I even have my mullet on anymore. I do not. That's perfect. Honestly, get out of here. Get lost. Ruining my good time here, buddy. Watch him throw his molt behind him, and he's gonna be right back over to it. You are some type of jerk. I got a dead one, we'll throw it to him. I got a generous heart. Here, doggy. Here, doggy. You wanna film this? He's already creeping up behind the boat. <laughs> you want mullet? That one look good. All right, we're gonna feed Buddy a mullet here, okay? It's like, you catch it, right? Oh, you suck. All right, we got it. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, God, the jack. <laughs> it's a little jack at that. And he foul hooked himself, that's great. A day of uh, wanting to catch snook and I've caught nothing but jack and I've missed nothing but snook. Seems very typical, honestly. Oh God. Come on, something big. Oh, come on, baby. Come on. Something big waked on this wall. I can't tell if it's still behind me or not. All right, I think we're gonna call it there. We're just about out of light. Need to pull the boat back onto the trailer. Today was an action-packed day. <laughs> an action-packed day. I didn't necessarily catch a lot of fish, and I was just kind of whipping fish left and right. I'm a little rusty on the live bait. I throw artificial so much that when I go back to throwing live bait, I always feel kind of funky, but I am determined to catch me a big snook in the next few days here, so I'll probably be throwing a lot of live bait, some big spooks, stuff like that, and trying to get a big one. I appreciate the heck out of you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, all that stuff. Today was a lot of fun. Honestly, there was fish just busting everywhere. Jack were going nuts. We got a few snook going airborne. I broke off a snook on literally the exact same spot, the exact same way. So I don't know why I didn't expect that, but that's just how life is. I'm having a hard uh, 22 years so far, but life goes on. I appreciate the heck out of you guys. Until next time, see you.